Welcome to Ascende Superius. This reflection is titled, Letting Go, The Discovery of Self in Jesus Christ. Peace is the archetype of the heavenly kingdom in our soul. It is the state of grace, the indwelling of the Holy Trinity in our hearts. As much peace as we would like to receive in our lives, the more we must be willing to give. The true anecdote for finding peace is to be free, free in Christ. Jesus says to us in the Gospel, My peace is not of this world. As Christians, it is imperative that we do not amalgamate our lives with the world, meaning, do not be a hypocrite, do not be a fence-sitter, lukewarm and undecided in your conviction to follow the Lord. For if we would be aware of the repercussions of such a faith, our Lord would rebuke us, saying, I do not know you, ye of little faith. To be a Christian means to pick up our cross and follow him. We try to avoid this as much as possible by redirecting our lives on paths that seemingly unburden us from acknowledging our issues, i.e. our sins, those things that are real and detrimental to our development as human beings in the image and likeness of God. By trying to bury our problems with denial or an attributed false piety, we only enmesh our soul in a spiritual torpor that causes our intellect to fall into paralysis where we cannot discern right from wrong. And so, Every choice that we make becomes an endless maze of trying to find the exit from our concerns. We live in a society of quick fixes. We will often grapple with the contradiction of the state of our interior life, which is so muddled with attachments while trying to adopt an outward life where everything seems perfect. But we are never change from within because we are so concerned with modeling ourselves on the material senses. By letting go of the world, we will gradually learn to be authentic, and by being authentic we will genuinely love. We will love all, even our enemies. We will follow the words of our Lord. This is my commandment that you love one another as I have loved you. And so, by detaching ourselves from a world of false loves and a false sense of peace, we begin the journey through the process of self-denial and the virtue of humility to become who we truly are. And by being ourselves in Christ, we find true love, a relationship that is other, and beyond all limitations. As difficult as it may be to let go of people, be aware of relationships built on Pharisaic expectations. The path of love is meek and humble, requiring our hearts to be vulnerable in imitation of him who spared no expense to show the love he has for us.